Hey there, what is up everyone? I am DCSK. Thanks for checking out my video. In this video, I'm gonna show you the ultimate guide to farm one of the very powerful armor in Ancient Hunt. It is the full metal armor, also the gilded variants of plate armor, claymore, great hammer, and power bow. Here are more ultimate guide on farming gilded item. It is right down there at the description. Make sure to check that out. Alright, the first thing you need to know is which rune to summon the instant mob that have a chance to drop this gilded item. It is the T and 2 plus rune to summon the instant unbreakable one. Now you can start to farm the item that assigned with this rune, just farm rare or common item is enough. You don't need to farm unique item for this rune, the drop rate is much lower and it takes more time to farm it. And there are many items that assigned with this rune, I have filtered it which and where so you can find it much more easier and faster. Now here's the table. This table contains all the information that you need. All these are recommended items to farm. Those items that are not shown in this table is not recommended to farm. And you can farm any way you like listed in this table. The best map to farm is at Fiery Forge, Lone Frotus, and Gale Sanctum. This three mission drops everything you need. And you just need two items to summon the unbreakable one. At Gale Sanctum, farm plate armor and claim more. If you want to go for 9 investment points, then just farm another ranged weapon. At Lone Frotus, farm plate armor and skater crossbow. If you want to go for 9 investment points, then just farm another melee weapon. And last one, this is the best place to farm in between of these 3 missions. At Fiery Forge, you can have 4 types of combination depending on what you get when farming. First combination, plate or scale mail and great hammer. At any types of bow, then you can go for 9 investment point run, but not power bow as stated at the back of the table. The rune is power bow, it will summon another or more instant mob in the run, so it is not recommended. Second, third and fourth combination is kinda same just different armor, means that in your combination must have great hammer and exploding crossbow, then add any types of armor, stun armor, mercenary armor or reinforced mail. Then you can start the hunt in as high as 9 maximum investment point. Very easy to farm, just farm repeatedly at this mission. Get everything you need, then you can farm your gilded gears in no time. If you have any question, you can hit me up at my Discord community. The link is at down there at the description. If you enjoy my content, consider to subscribe and hit the like button, it is free. It will help me a lot and I'm very appreciated. Alright, so to farm all these items faster, choose the difficulty that you can one shot with your ranged weapon. If you're unsure, then just select the easiest difficulty. If your power level is at 250, then Apocalypse plus 10 is a good choice. Then equip armor and artifact that increase movement speed. Melee weapon with prospectors and chairman. It is not necessary to have this. If you have it, it is a bonus, so you can earn some emerald while farming item. And hub crossbow, if you don't have hub crossbow, lightning hub or skater crossbow will do. With hub crossbow, you can kill much faster. You can also buy this item from merchant, check it out from time to time and restock if you have some emerald. If you see the specific item that you want, just buy from them. It will save you a lot of time and don't restock too many times, it will cost you a lot unless you are rich. If you want to get rich and farm easy experience, you can check out my video. The link is up here or down there at the description. Make sure to check that out, it can help you to get rich and earn a lot of experience just by standing. Alright, once you have everything, equip the best skill you have, then you can start the hunt now. I recommend you to go with 6 points is good enough. If you wish to go with 9 maximum points for even higher chance, yes, you can do that. If you are having trouble to go 9 maximum points, you can check out my video on AFK farm experience. It is a very simple guide and you can earn a lot of level just by standing. The link is up here or down there at the description. As for the difficulty, select based on your gear capability and of course, the higher difficulty, the better item power level drop. In the hunt, just look for the purple glowing door to be the ancient unbreakable one. This spot is super hard, so you have to be well prepared. If you are going for melee fight, it is better to have power shaker, death cap mushroom and gong of weakening. Once the boss appeared, he will immediately smash the ground and cast about 14 random mines on the ground. This is the best and only time you can attack him. Ignore his minion, now go full swing and active whatever you have to deal as much as damage as you can. Oh, I almost forgot. It is better to have potion barrier enchantment on your armor, active it and rush to them to kill like a boss. 
You can also one shot instant kill the boss by using Torment Quiver, equip an item that can add soul, for me I use soul bow with dynamo enchantment, and make sure to gather some soul before you enter the boss arena. Charge up at least 4 stack of dynamo, active Torment Quiver, then charge shoot to finish the boss. Ta da! And here's your guild item! Pick it up and to the next door. And every time after you finish the instant hunt, it will refresh the Picking Merchant store. So make sure to check out the Picking Merchant for new stock of guild item. It might have something that you are looking for. If you see the guild item that you want, just buy from him. Alright guys, I hope this ultimate guide can help you to farm guild full metal armor and other guild gears much faster. If you have any question or suggestion, you can leave a comment below. You can also find me at my Discord community, everyone is welcoming. I hope you enjoy and find some useful info in this video. And before you leave, make sure to hit the like and subscribe button, it is free. So happy hunting, thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.